Uh-huh, uh-huh. Golf Boys, Maine. 2000 Trizatine. Trizatine. Ben Cranes. We running this short game. Hit them in the net. As you can see, there are several different kinds of golf balls. Different brands, different colors, everything. And I chose to do my chemistry of project on three types of Titleist golf balls. The first ball I chose was the NXT Tour. It's a three-piece hybrid ball. It has an outstanding distance and a very consistent ball flight, which are some of the reasons why golfers choose to play with this type of ball. The next ball I chose is the DT Solo. This is a two-piece ball that Mr. Beals really needs to start using because it minimizes the unwanted slice or hook on the ball, and it'll keep him in the fairway and out of the trees. The final ball I chose is the four-piece Pro V1X. This is the ball that most professional golfers favor because it has a low initial spin used for distance and a high iron spin used for precision. So now we're going to take a little journey to the woodshop room where Mr. Robertson was kind enough to cut open the balls for me. They turned out pretty cool, so let's go take a look at what's really inside a golf ball. Yeah. <laughs> so after Mr. Robertson cut up all the balls, this is what they looked like. The two-piece, the three-piece, and the four-piece. So now I'm going to teach you a little bit about what really is inside a golf ball. Alright, so now that we have the balls cut open, I'm going to teach you what is inside them by simulating the creation of golf balls by making cupcakes. Way funner, right? Okay, so I'm going to only make one cupcake today, so the cupcake I'm going to make is going to represent the Pro V1X, which is a four-piece ball, so it'll have four different parts, and it'll be really delicious, and it'll be a good showing of how to create this Pro V1X golf ball and the elements and ingredients that are involved in creating this golf ball. So, let's get started. The first thing I'm going to do is make the cover of the golf ball. The cover in the Pro V1X is made out of urethane elastomer, which is, urethane is a colorless toxic powder used as a solvent, and elastomer is a material that has the elastic properties of rubber. So the cover protects the ball, so I'm going to use cupcake holders that protect the cupcake as the cover in the cupcakes. So now we have the chocolate batter that I'm going to put into the cupcakes. The chocolate batter represents the casing that surrounds the golf ball and the core. The casing is made out of a sterlin ionomer, which means the material softens when it's heated and hardens when it's cool. Alright, so this next part is going to be the two-piece core. The core in the Provo X is made out of polybutadiene. Polybutadiene is a polymer that has a double carbon bond in mostly butadiene. Here is the double carbon bonds right here, and this is the 1,3-butadiene molecular structure. So in the cupcake, we have one part, which is the cream cheese filling, and we're going to sprinkle in some chocolate chips to make it dual core in the cupcake. Alright, so we'll... So now we're going to place the two-piece core inside the middle of the casing, just like it is in the Pro V1 golf ball. So now we'll wait and put these in the oven, and in a little bit our product will be all finished. All finished. Now I can't wait to have a cupcake. So, I hope you enjoyed learning about what's in a golf ball and how to make a golf ball cupcake. And I will see you never.